Unit 17. How are things? Good morning. Impress the printing. This is Anna Baker. Good morning, Anna. Mr. Stewart, how are things? I'm okay. Things here are going along well. How are things there? Going great. That's good. How did your meeting with the sales rep go? Very good. His prices for many things were quite reasonable, so I stocked up on office supplies. Like what? Well, you know, paper clips, staples, A4 paper, glue, those sort of things. Okay. Good. Good. And pens with our company logo too. Oh, good. I like those. Hey, anything major going on in the office that I should know about? No, we're holding down the fort here for you. Great. Has James come in yet? Yes, he has. Could you transfer me to him? Of course. Thanks, Anna. Oh, one more thing. Yes. I'll be arriving tomorrow at 1:30 in the afternoon on United Airlines Flight 106. I'll have the driver waiting for you there. Great, thanks. Okay, pass me along to James now, please. See you tomorrow, Mr. Stewart. Goodbye. Mr. Stewart, how are things? How did your meeting with the sales rep go? Hey, anything major going on in the office that I should know about? No, we're holding down the fort here for you. Great. Has James come in yet? I'll have the driver waiting for you there. Great. Thanks. Okay. Pass me along to James now, please. Good afternoon, Mr. Stewart. Have you had a comfortable flight? Yes, of course. Is James here? Yes, he is. He's in his office working right now. Ah, yes. He's always responsible and hard working. In fact, he's been working too hard. Well, it's time for us to look for a new secretary. Yes. We lack people, and we're going to work on an important project. Well, yes, and I also need someone to assist me in the coming time. Yes, I've noticed a distinctive resume. Would you like me to hold an interview with her? Good, Anna. Please prepare an interview next week. I will have a talk with her. Okay, Mr. Stewart. Next Friday morning is the most suitable. As you'll have meetings with customers on the other weekdays. Okay, please inform the candidate about the appointment, Anna. Well, it's time for us to look for a new secretary. Well, yes, and I also need someone to assist me in the coming time. Yes. I've noticed a distinctive resume. Would you like me to hold an interview with her? Okay, Mr. Stewart. Next Friday morning is the most suitable, as you'll have meetings with customers on the other weekdays. Okay. Please inform the candidate about the appointment, Anna. Hello. Is this Miss Jane? Yes, Jane is speaking. I am calling from the Impressive Printing. We've had a look at your resume, and we would like to have an interview with you next Friday. Are you available to come? Yes, I am available next Friday. Okay, Jane, can you be here at 9:30 a.m. next Friday? 
And can you please bring along a hard copy of your resume? Yes, of course. Okay, see you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Hello, is this Miss Jane? I am calling from the impressive printing. We've had a look at your resume, and we would like to have an interview with you next Friday. Are you available to come? Okay, Jane. Can you be here at 9.30 a.m. next Friday? And can you please bring along a hard copy of your resume? Unit 19, New Horizons. Hi, Dave. How was the funeral? Oh, pretty good, I suppose, as far as those things go. It's good to have you back, Dave. We missed you while you were gone. Yeah, right. I guess things have been pretty quiet around here without me. Not a chance of that. Things have been quite busy around here since you've left. Oh, that's what I like to hear. Now, let's get to work. James, Sue, how was the meeting this morning? Well, they made an interesting proposition. Summarize for me. Give me the quick version. Well, in a nutshell, they've matched Floyd's loan of 1.5 million, but with a minimal 1% interest rate. My goodness, that's too good to be true. What's the catch? The bank wants 10% ownership, and the factory has to be located in China. Have the factory in China? Sue, what do you think of that? The cost of setting up a new factory in China would be a fraction of the cost of setting one up here. Why is that? Labor, land, and materials are all cheaper there, and the government has tax-free economic zones. Huh? Why didn't we think of that? It's incredible that we didn't think of setting up the factory in China earlier. It seems so obvious now. Dave, what are you thinking? What am I thinking? I'm thinking if they don't speak English in China, you better begin practicing Mandarin. Ni hao ma means hello in Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Dave. How was the funeral? Oh, pretty good, I suppose, as far as those things go. James, Sue, how was the meeting this morning? Well, they made an interesting proposition. Summarize for me. Give me the quick version. My goodness, that's too good to be true. What's the catch? The bank wants 10% ownership, and the factory has to be located in China. Unit 1, The Interview. Introduction. My name is Jane. I'm only 24 years old, and today is my first day at my new job. I'm very excited. I've just graduated from university. I can't wait to start working and meet new friends. Hmm. I don't know what to wear today. Shall I wear this one or this one? I choose this one. My new job is wonderful. Do you want to know how I got it? It all started with an interview. 
Hi, my name's Jane. I'm only 24 years old. And today is my first day at my new job. I've just graduated from university. I'm here for the interview. Yes, yes. Thank you. Goodbye. Hello, I'm here for the interview. What's your name? My name is Jane. Hi, Jane. And who are you seeing? Mr. Smith, the sales and marketing manager. Okay, just take the lift to the fifth floor. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Good luck. Hello, I'm here for the interview. Hi, Jane. And who are you seeing? Mr. Smith, the sales and marketing manager. Educational experience. Have you been waiting long? No, I just arrived here. Well, it's nice to meet you. Thank you. I'm very glad for this opportunity. When did you graduate from university? I graduated six months ago. What faculty were you in? I was in the Faculty of Secretarial Studies. Did you enjoy studying? I did enjoy studying, but I wanted to start work as soon as possible. That's good. Thank you. I'm very glad for this opportunity. When did you graduate from university? I graduated six months ago. What faculty were you in? I was in the Faculty of Secretarial Studies. Work experience. Would you like to see my resume? Yes, please. Here's my resume. Thank you. Could you tell me where was your last job? Certainly. I was working at the Asia Finance Bank. And why did you leave that job? Because I was looking for more of a challenge. Any other reasons? Also, it was far from home. Well, I am looking for a new secretary. If you give me this job, I will work very hard. Would you like to see my resume? Yes, please. Could you tell me where was your last job? Certainly. I was working at the Asia Finance Bank. And why did you leave that job? Because I was looking for more of a challenge.